on this week's episode of Life at Love Luxury. So this Giveaways. Is given away to a lady in celebrations oh and renovations. So this La Mer was given away to a lady. We love giving stuff away and we love giving back to you guys. So make sure you enter all our giveaways on TikTok and Instagram. She is going to be sent this out on Monday. There you go. So and she that, won. And that's like £360. Yeah, this, it's got a, a value in the store of like £360. Yeah, that's what we paid for it. That's what we paid for it. So I'm going to look at what this is. Do you know what it's used for? You probably don't know what it's used for. Uh, so they used to use this bag to feed horses. So put the hay in there. But what you're buying is the brand. Because people that buy this have a collection and they probably have this same colour in like the Birkins and the Kellys and they really want it in different colours. This is a really popular bag, by the way. She, as I know she was telling as me. And I know it's not for everybody, I do know that, but um, this particular colour is so beautiful. Barry goes to a lot of watches, so she gets lots of clients that message her um, like daily with watches. I think I've been sent about four or five already this morning. These are the only two I've got at the moment, a Pepsi on a Jubilee and a Batman. So hopefully if we get any soon, I can message you and let you know. Um, also, you can try if you can find it somewhere else. But if you're interested in any of the pieces we've got in store, you've got my number, you can just message me and come back. Why well, are you all being really, really brilliant to me? I feel bad, but... Um, I wish, I had, bad. I I wish <laughs> I had a Batgirl. Yeah, if you had a Batgirl, then, then it's for you. I had it last week, yeah. what we sold there. Don't rush into it. As I told you last time, it's not about like, rushing. It's just about taking your time. We're always here. And it's your first yeah. watch, so it has to be something perfect. you actually want. It has to be perfect. Yeah. Maybe go to a Rolex boutique. Yeah, and try one. Yeah, 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 that's a good idea. I'll, I'll give that a go. I think that might be the, the best solution. I can then give you a call and say, look, I really like that one. Can you let me know if it comes in? Of course. Yeah. I think that's the best solution, really. Yeah. yeah. See the difference between both of them? Clients of ours came in to purchase a Chanel Classic flap. There is this one. Let me put the one each side. Maybe they're going to see the difference now. Damn it. <laughs> They're not meant to be worn crossbody, to be yeah. honest. No, they're like double or on the shoulder, oh, but people have just started wearing them crossbody. Mm. <laughs> With medium, you've got a lot of options. Yeah. This one doesn't have a card. Okay. So this is 6,000. If you want to have a card, let me get you the right. Do we remove the small one? Yeah, okay. maybe for the next time we the better it is, the better condition basically, because this is a little bit, if you can see it, sits a little bit tilted, so I would just have these two. So they're different years, so every year okay. they, you know, every year they're a little bit change. Yeah. This comes as a full set, so it has the card and everything. This one comes, this one comes with a dust bag and authentication only. This is 6,000 and this is 6,200. Some people are very picky, they would want a full set. And prefer it, wouldn't you? Yeah, but yeah, but I mean, it's just the card difference. Mm -hmm. So the card is worth two hundred pounds, basically. That's why we added the two hundred pounds on. I would take it as a full set, to be honest. I would yeah, too. it's just because when you resell it, if you're planning to resell it, yeah. Well, it's lovely to have it as a full set, yeah. the way you got it from the store, basically. It looks very clean, but it doesn't really have signs of use. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. We try to buy a bag that's are in a very good condition. Like we do get offered sometimes bags. Condition, but for the customer, for their full experience, we try to just buy the bag that's very good condition. I think this would be the one. Have a think about it. Yeah. I'll give you my number, and if anything, just message me on WhatsApp and I'll be able to help you. That Birkin 35? How much? Birkin, the Birkin, size yeah, is 35. 35. Do you want the size? Do you want me to show you? Yeah, size? you can show Okay, me, no problem. No, this is new box fresh. Never been used. There you go. I can open the mirror for you. You can have a look at yourself. It really suits you. This one is 21,000. 
about the bigger one? The bigger one is 17,000. So the bigger, the cheaper it is, the smaller, the more expensive yeah. it is. Yeah, smaller yeah. Reason. We have the mini Kelly, they're for like 28, 27,000. And then this is, this one is, that's how the market is because yeah, people like smaller bag. There you go. I like this one on you more. And you tell me about this one. This is 22,000. And this is 24, I think. 23, sorry, 23,000. Different prices? Yeah, so the price really depends because this is more popular color. This is more hard color to get. And then this is easier color. So each bag has a different price, basically. But these are all new, box fresh, never been used. Would you like to see anything else? No, thank you very much. No problem. No problem. I don't tell you are open tomorrow. Tomorrow we're not open. We only close on uh, on Sunday, and then we open oh, Monday to Saturday. Yeah, we open oh. Monday to Saturday. Hello. That was a very quick decision. Can we take that? Yes. How would you like to pay for it? I ask her the question. How would you like to pay for it? I ask her something. As you please. What's the price? No. 6,200. Could we do 6,200? Well, card. Okay. Her father made an offer which I then took to Adam who was standing out front. Okay, can I ask her another uh -huh. get back to you? Yes, sorry. Yeah, right. No problem. Just give me a second. Thank you. Yep, that's going to work. Thank you. Thank you very much. No problem. That's She's fine. Oh, yeah, but I've been having that for 25 years, my life. <laughs> What's another 25? She, she deserves the father she's got. <laughs> you understand that? Yeah? Mm. Oh, excuse me. Oh. Thank you for accepting that. No, you're very welcome. <laughs> Come on, you've got to do the business. Is business. business is business, yeah. And you know that. <laughs> well done for this. And you've got the bus pass as well. Put that in here as well. Oh, thank you. Yeah, thank you, sir. Thank you. <laughs> okay, so let me just... Are you happy with it? Yes. Silly question. <laughs> I'm interested. How did you start this? What made this happen? So I, so I used to be in the pawnbroking business. When in my other stores, I used to buy a lot of like what diamonds, watches, gold, okay. handbags, okay. and we used to get a lot of handbags. And they used to sell right. really easily. I was like, hold on a minute. Is this multi international or are you just English? As are you this in England? Oh, yeah, so yes, I grew up in London, impressed. all in London. Impressed, mate, impressed. Yeah. So, what's oh, your gosh. Well, no, obviously, <laughs> the age I am, I'm only 27. Yeah, of course, of course. You know that? <laughs> and dyslexic. Okay, no, no. <laughs> so, so my life. No, 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 no. Yeah. Um, no, retired, and you know, yeah. So, I've just had the uh, great fortune of being able to sell my mum and dad's house. Okay, that's good. So, even to contemplate yeah. this. Yeah, because it's, it's, it's a big no, spread. It's a big spread. She would end up when I die anyway, yeah. she'll get it. Yeah. <laughs> not the point. Of course. But you're not going to get it for nothing. Of course. You work for it, like <laughs> of course. I've done. Yeah. So, how much was the roller? Is that yours? Yeah, that no, no. So, basically, I gifted it to my dad. I gave it to him as a gift. Aww. Because yeah, he, he's my mentor, he's my role model. So, a couple of years back, I, I was yeah, he obviously. Brought you up in the right way too. He's great. He's a great businessman as well. He's um, a very successful entrepreneur. I paid forty thousand dollars for this. Forty thousand dollars because I was in New York. So diamonds are a great investment, often overlooked by people. Can I have my loot, please? Can I see the ring? So this client bought a prodigious diamond ring to us as she wanted an instant payout. I'm gonna get you clothes and whatever this is the biggest, I'm just gonna get rid of it. Of course, no, 100%. It's been in my drawer for like 10 years now. So I have multiple connections with people in the diamond industry to make sure that what we receive is exactly what we're supposed to be buying and selling here at Love Luxury. And I was told it has the number in there as well. Then I could check that, yeah. Inscribe? Yeah. So they know it's registered to my name. Lazy description, yeah, it's got it in there. You have it in the two or four on the girdle. When the guy, I when I bought it in New York, he said to me, even if you lose it, it will be registered to your name. Yeah, yeah. I can check the number for you if that matches, but it'll match. I know it'll match no. 100%. I can see it's that. Really yeah, I check <laughs> this. Yeah, now I check these two marks and I can see them on there. Do you have anything in your mind? I don't know. I have no clue. Because what I would suggest is, I'll like. Um, Do you want to have a look around and send me a message? Yeah, yeah, I'm going to send you a message 100% anyway. Um, I'm just waiting for the rap report to update because the updated, it hasn't been updated yet, uh, which is basically the diamond price grade. 
So it's basically, it's, it's, it's like currency. Diamonds are like currency. Okay. Yeah, so I can give you an accurate price. I don't, I don't need to see the ring. I can see that ring matches this. I, I've just, I've checked it. I know yeah. this is for that, yeah? Okay. I don't really need to check the inscription. I can see it's 100% fine. Um, all I need to do is just get the accurate price and I can tell you the price. If you're happy, you just come in, I'll pay you straight away. So the way it would work is you just bring that ring with this together, yeah. your ID, which is a driving license or a passport and yeah. a utility bill. You just pop in here. It takes me about 10 minutes. I can check very quickly. And then my colleague will just do the paper for you and I'll, I'll get you paid straight away without any problems whatsoever and, and i'm gonna message you next week. probably on monday morning when they update the sheet at 12 o'clock what's, oh, yeah. what's, what's your number i'm very 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 confident we're gonna get a deal done yeah yeah i'll make it i'll make sure that it's the, the best for you so you're happy and i'll make sure that for us it works for both of us because i know it's a, yeah it worked for both of us i'll make sure that it's, it's good for us thank you so much no you're very welcome thank, thank you for coming down so this was a substantial deal for the client i made sure she went away and considered all of her options hi how are you Yes, so we have the Damier, mm -hmm. we have pink, mm -hmm. epi leather, and then we have black epi leather. And we had another one, I thought, but I sold it. Two, one, uh, two, mm. three. Only a few. Mm. <laughs> I insist all of our clients feel, try and be apparelled in bags before they buy them as it is always a significant occasion. You can hold them if you want. You sure? Yeah. Open um, them, hold them, try them, test them. Yeah, you'll have the... Of course, yeah, so yeah, they do inside. I was looking for ones that had, you know, this colour, like the Aldi and all the fun stuff was all over I haven't seen it in one enough for such a long time to be honest. I actually haven't seen it for ages yeah. in monogram. Let's have a look online, do they still make them in monogram? I've been looking on the Vestia collective. Is that the new models or older ones? I think they might be older ones. ones because yeah. I don't remember them. Because I now I think the new ones are yeah. like Epi and Damier. We tend not to take like the older older mm. ones because we find it a bit harder to sell. So we stick to like That's newer good. models. Yeah, yeah. Um, but I can definitely just have a look because I'm taking Mono. Okay, okay. okay. They, they, it's, they still, is it available in the store? But yeah, it's, yeah, it's available, yeah, okay. it's available, yeah. But if your heart's set on something, then you know your heart's set on something. Yeah, that's yeah. the thing, my heart is set on it. On the monogram. If you follow us on Instagram, um, we have a story mm -hmm. and then we post like bags that come in. Okay. And then we do like special offers when they first come in. I... So then you can get like a really good deal on like the exact okay. bag you want. It's very good. My friend bought a cartoon bracelet. Of course, yeah. Right. But she doesn't know if it's real or not. So I can check that for her. Me and Emily can check that. Okay. Because we're both authenticators in Cartier. Okay. Um, and I can very easily tell if it's genuine or not. It's hard to tell now because the pics are so good whether or not. Bangs are real. I mean, first of all, you test to see if it's real gold. Mm. Then you see the the like the serial numbers because mm. I've seen the fake ones. Mm. They always make the mistakes with serial numbers. Oh, okay. Yeah, there's, there, there's an order it needs to be in. Mm. They need to know the order. They need mm. to know how it works. Mm. And most of the people who make these bangles, you know, mm. or they've got duplicates on the system. If you go, even Google the serial number, there might be like a hundred yeah. different hundred cartes with the same serial yeah. number. It's also yeah. pieces and also with the serum because it's in um, it's inscribed in the inner of the bracelet mm. the machine that does that with Cartier is so perfect mm. that you can see perfection when you look for a loop okay a loop is like a magnifying glass if I bought something can I bring it here for you to yes so I mean if you check online mm -hmm. um, um, I think we're probably the only people that are authenticating okay. for people yeah. for a peace of mind mm. okay that's yeah. good to know thank you so much yeah, if you ever need any help, you can let us know. You can message us, call us, WhatsApp us um, from the website. Um, and then we can definitely, like, if there's something you're wanting, definitely keep an eye out on the Instagram stories. And our, we have a website as well. Good to know. Yeah. Thank you. You're very welcome. This is for, we have reached over 200,000 on Instagram followers and as usual it shot up so fast that we've missed the mark and we are now on like 201.8 or 201.9 but nonetheless it's still a momentous occasion. When we let them go, we're going to let them go like that. We all just pop them in that direction, so like up there. To celebrate 200,000 on Instagram, we had a cake made. It was gigantic and it had miniature figurines of myself, Adam and Moo. Thank you so much. We've reached another milestone, but this time it's on Instagram. 200,000, so we've hit our, our next mark. Thank you so much, guys. We appreciate you following us and... Yes, let's get to a million. So Maria decided to let the cannon off right by my ear. Thank you. Oh my lord! <laughs>
Those confetti cannons were blaring. Can I try? <laughs> oh, wow. Emily got this massive cake made, which had a little Moo and Emily and someone that does not look like Adam on it. Name is Zara Brown, or you'll get smacked. Yves Saint Laurent. Mm -hmm. So lucky you are. How do you get it to start again? Yeah, you have to stop it. Adam and I did a TikTok trend where we had to name a designer brand that was after the letter that came on the screen. Chanel. Just ask a question again. Okay, ready, Emily? What do you think it's going to be? Getting some smacks, getting some smacks, getting some smacks. <laughs> Fendi! Uh, swap sides. Do you have to swap sides? No, you don't, but you have to go through the, through the camera and get the letter in the Yeah, ready? You're not going to get it this time. Gonna get it, gonna get it, gonna get it, gonna get it. <laughs> It was really fun because I got to beat him up with the pillow. So this morning we've got some builders in. We're going to be renovating the front of the store, and we've got some. Uh, we've got new windows, new doors to prevent any issues. We've got bulletproof VAB glass going in. So we've cleared out the store because we've got a lot of work going on at the moment. So everything's going to be away, locked away in the safe. I'm also going to be working from the store. I'm going to be working from upstairs. Uh, we're still in the building um, as we've got the whole building here. So we're going to be cleaning everything out together um, and so the builders can get to work so we can get our new doors and windows fitted. Yes, I can't wait. We are prepping for London Fashion Week. Moo and myself have been invited to a couple of fashion shows and Moo's also walking, but that's not for another couple of days. So Sophia has come down to do my makeup. Um, Sophia, what's the name of your company? Sophia Shaka, anyway. Sophia Shaka and UA is doing my makeup. Are you doing this kind of stuff? Yeah, maybe the speaker. Oh, wait, 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 speaker. We've got the shelf, maybe. Yeah. Yeah, put the shelf. So let's empty it. Let's put any, these bits on the shelf here. Okay. Most importantly, go and put these in my vault. Okay. They keep them safe for our Russians. Hi, good morning. Good morning. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. I'm glad I can talk to you. Let's have a look for you. Yeah. Uh, a couple of years ago, I received a gift. Okay. A Gucci bag. Okay. Cute one. Hold for me? Yeah, the receipts are inside. Quite cute. And what do you want to do with this one? Well, I would like to sell it. We would be happy to make an offer on this on, on this item. At the moment, we couldn't do anything because we're renovating. Yeah. Um, we're usually open Monday to Saturday. It's just we're changing the whole place. We're making it newer. But I can give you my number, and in a couple of hours, if if, if you haven't sold it by then, then we can give you a price. And if you're happy, then you come down. We can then pay you straight away. Okay, just a question. Tomorrow is your price. You don't know now. Top of my head, I don't know because I'm not familiar with this. Okay. More, I price more Hermes, okay. Okay, Birkins and Kelly's that you probably see. So what yeah. you should write it in the message. I'll give you my WhatsApp. Okay. okay yeah. Perfect. So on the WhatsApp, you can send me a picture of it and just send a picture of the receipt and say, um, I want to sell this. How much will I get? Yeah, see, a few hours. Uh, you're busy. Yeah. Yeah. So lunchtime. Yeah, it's lunchtime. Yeah, hundred percent. Hello, my name is Jonathan. I came to Love Luxury today to sell my Patek Philippe 5711. It's actually, it, it, it was one of my favorite watches after the 5811. Now the 5811 has come out, the new version in the white gold, oh, in the 41 mil, we had one. It was pounced down for my father. It was a brand new watch. I love it a lot, but I don't wear it, so I personally have to sell it. I got an AP. That's here. very, very yeah. nice. I prefer that. I do prefer AP. Yeah. 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 Do you have a price in mind that you might be Around looking at? 70, because I've seen watches but. in that. Price is around 80,000 plus. Mm -hmm. I do realize no paper is going to be a big issue. We try our best to buy watches as a full set with original box and papers, but we do get some clients that misplaced or lose their papers. I would take it on the phone. Yeah. I wouldn't trust go out and buy and get without because papers. Without papers. Yeah. This watch belonged to the client's father who passed away, which is why he didn't have the papers. Is the price negotiable? I would say it is, but not by a lot of margin. Because if I sell it like online, it could be a higher price, but I just don't want the hassle of going everywhere. Yeah, but you just have to keep in mind that it doesn't have papers, so we would really struggle to sell it. I'll speak to my boss. Alaikum as salam, 5711. It's got, the, it's got the newer dial, not the older version. Adam made some calls to some of our contacts in the industry to see if we can get a deal done on it. It's got no papers. It comes with a box, all the links. It's in a very good condition. It's in a, it's in a very good condition, meaning it feels like it's not mm, even worn. Yeah, almost it's mint. Almost, it's, got some, it's still got stickers on it at the back. 
on the class for only. There's a 2019 full set box and papers for 70 that we have on Israel. I don't know. Would you leave it on consignment? It is a possibility. Even though it did not have papers, I still wanted to see what I can do for him and come for a deal, especially that it's one of my favorite watches. If you, for example, made up your mind and you want to drop it to us on consignment, I can take your number and we can stay in contact. We can, if once the watch has been sold, we can even pay international banks. It just mm, has to I be see. under your name. Um, so have a think about it. Mm. I'm happy to offer you 70,000 on consignment. Yeah, I'm, yeah. Happy to, yeah. I'm happy to offer you 70,000 on consignment. Um, once you've thought about it properly, you can just give me a call and um, we can take it from there. Just have a think about it and then let me know. I'll give you my phone number. We're never in a rush. We don't mind the client going away and having to think about it to make sure it's the right decision for them. I heard it's tough but to I sell think once we can a new one had came. No, really? No, no. Because, because we struggled sold. We struggled to sell the 5811, but we sold the 5711. Oh, that's interesting. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. So this young man did exactly that, and I'm 100% sure he's going to come back. Yeah. Especially like the Muslim community, they mm -hmm. wear steel, they don't wear gold, oh, so I they see. tend to go to the steel. Mm -hmm. And we've got a lot of people from abroad mm -hmm. um, and from Arab countries. Have a think about it. You've got my number. Okay. You can just I'll message me know. whenever. We appreciate Thank you for coming yeah, in. Thank you. We just had a client that's just coming with a 5711. Very nice watch without the papers. The only problem for us is that we need to send it to Patek, we need to get the archive paperwork, um, we need to confirm the year and then to make a reasonable offer. He's had an offer. Um, I don't believe that the people that have made the offer are going to go ahead with that because it seems like it's um, slightly over what everyone's looking to pay. So I know the gentleman's going to come back. So let's wait for him to come back. Do you really think he's going to come back? A hundred percent, because I know he's probably checked who we are um, and he's confident to walk in here and to have a great, relaxed conversation with us. Uh, he seemed like a very nice gentleman. I'm sure we can get a deal done. That watch was literally in a mint condition. I would really like to take it on consignment. Well, let's see. You never know. As in, I would want, you know, as I wanted to buy it, but it's just the price needs to be right for us in order for us to hold it in stock. Um, with papers, I think it's something we'd definitely buy. But without the papers, as you know, it's things that we don't really take on board. But we can take it as long as he has all of his bits. Thanks for watching. And don't forget to join us next week for another episode of Life at Love Luxury.